welcome to Shamrock Rovers Fan TV. Now, in preparation for the League of Ireland returning, Shamrock Rovers have played some behind closed doors friendlies. So, in today's video, we're going to go over them. We started off beating Lucan United 6 0, and on the same day, beating Cliftonville 3 0. Now, around a week ago, Shamrock Rovers travelled down to Athlone to play in the Athlone Town Stadium against Athlone Town and win a 4 0 win with Dean Williams, the Wonder Kids, getting a goal. Max Murphy with two and Aaron McInef with the last goal. Now yesterday as I record this, the Hoops welcomed Wexford FC to Tallah Stadium in a friendly which the Hoops won 4-1 with Rovers leading 3-0 at half time. The goals came from Ronan Finn, Dean Williams getting two including a penalty and Sean Brennan. Wexford's goal came from Connor English. Now news on Twitter said that a Rovers player was stretchered off and they said it was Greg Bulger. Um, hopefully it's not out. It's not for too long. He's a great player. And we really badly need him. So speedy recovery to Greg. Now Shamrock Rovers two, our B team travelled down to Waterford to play against Waterford in the RSC. It was an unfortunate result, but against a good team. In the third minute, Will Longbottom put the Blues ahead inside the six-yard box. After twenty-three minutes, Waterford doubled their lead with Ali Coote making it 2-0. 89 minutes in, the Hoops pulled one back with Jamie Doyle slotting the ball past Ryan. Now, unfortunate news came from this as Michael O'Connor could be out for a while, so I wish him the best luck. Hopefully, he gets a speedy recovery. Now, on the same day as the game against Wexford and the game against Waterford, the Hoops played Cavan Teeley and in a 2-1 win from goals from Thomas Alua in the first half. And Dylan Watts with a great free kick in the second half. If you enjoyed today's video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.